Sagatos Manor, as you can see. Um, I really love this place. It's closed, the manor, but um, the grounds are still open, so we're going to walk around. We're going to see what we could hear and what we could find. It's very quiet today. Nobody's here, so that's good. We'll go by the cemetery. We'll say hello to the spirits and... Um, around the house a little you can't go in the house like I said but even the buttery is closed they have it closed you know because the house isn't open for tours but let's see what we can find so I just love this house I really do it's so gorgeous Always look at the windows to see if anything exciting is happening in the windows. <laughs> you can never know what you can find here. Um, so very cool. So we'll go around the house, then we'll go to the cemetery. that noise? Is there a car or it almost sounded like something on the... Sounded like something on the front porch. They have the windows like closed, most of them. I guess because it's not opened right now. But. It did almost sound like something on the porch. Huh. Yeah, I have to put the candle in the window. Alrighty. Oh, that window's open. A lot of sun glare. I don't know if you guys could see anything in there. Let's try to go this way. Mm. There's those little windows up there, but. Now I can't see because the sun is blazing in my face, but okay, let's see what else we got. Oh, they really got to fix the roof. Look at all of that coming up.
love how they put the candles in every window. Now this is the door, this was the original door, and this is the door that on the other side has the handle uh, which George Washington touched. So that was cool. We took a tour here. It is on the channel if you want to see the inside tour. We have a few Sagatos Manor ones. This place is really gorgeous. Um, let's go back around the other side. And look at that. <laughs> There's just mansions everywhere. That somebody actually lives in. Gorgeous house there too. Let's try to go down. They, they're doing a lot of work here, cleaning it up, I guess, taking down some trees. where the fireplace is, the big one, which we saw that. I filmed that in the video. And then we're back to where the buttery was. Sorry. Ooh, sun. And like I said, most of the windows, um, they have, uh, you know, so the light doesn't get in and ruin stuff. They have the shades up. There is two windows up there that don't have shades. Um, I don't know if you could see anything. But the rest, I think, all have shades. Um, and this door is where you would come out of the gift shop. This window is weird. It looks like, like it's semi up. Hmm. I don't know. It's hard to tell with these windows. The glass panes are really old. So because they're so old and they're like double paned, they're really really hard to see. Uh, the glare is usually terrible. Um, but yeah, so now we'll go see the rest. There's my boyfriend sitting there. He came with me today. We'll go see the rest of the garden. I love the garden. Want to go see the garden? Ooh. I love the garden. It's so pretty. <laughs> it's so funny. They closed the door, but you could just walk that way. It's kind of weird. Anyway. <laughs> Yeah, like they closed the door to the gazebo. But you could just go in this way. Uh -huh. and this is the garden. So supposedly this is one of the most haunted places in Long Island because it's been here so long since 16 something. Um, I think it's 1669 or 62 or something. Um, but I tell you, I don't get any really super haunty feelings here. Um, it's actually quite peaceful. 
I'm sure there's spirits here, but maybe they're not pissy. Just hanging out. <laughs> um, just hanging out. Um, yeah, this is the... Um, little house where they have like the tool shed I should say and I can't walk over there because there's stuff there but that's the tool shed like a tree in there the garden pretty I told my boyfriend oh well come see the carriage house <laughs> my boyfriend's like I don't want to go there um, I, I think I told you guys my boyfriend sees um, auras <laughs> so he's like holy crap I don't like this place <laughs> um, <laughs> he hates coming with me to haunty places he only came with me today because across the street is a cool walking trail which we'll go on I've taken you guys there before I went with Jonathan um, and wanted to check it out so yeah but anyway we'll go say hello to the Indian girl um, and we'll go look in the uh, If you guys see anything that I don't see or hear, let me know down in the comments. I just really love this place. Aw, they broke her rocks. So, grave of the Indian girl, name unknown. God bless you. I hope you're resting in peace. See? Yeah. There's a shit load of spirits here. Uh, I know that. They don't come out much though, well for me anyway. <laughs> me? Oh no. I don't know. Let's go peek at the carriage house. Now, behind here guys, I know I told you before, but if you're new to the channel and do not know, um, this land used to be way bigger. So basically, the land went from here all the way down to the water and went through like four or five towns because back in the day, you only had to pay taxes on land that was on the water. So they only had a little piece of land on the water and then it went all the way back. So it was thin and long. But anyway, behind here, used to be a racetrack um, so that was really cool so there used to be a racetrack here behind here but now they sold off most of the land and whatever land is left is this little land which is owned by um, Suffolk County now um, and used like as a museum I can't wait till they fix this up and open it because I would love to see in here um, I know they said they're working on it. They will open it soon to the public, so that's good. In the front, you could definitely see more. Um, because here, you really can't, you see all the bushes. You really can't get here. But yeah, behind here used to be a whole big racetrack. Um, so yeah. So we'll look in the windows, <laughs> like we always do. I don't think they did any work with it lately. It still kind of looks the same in here. I don't know. Did you just say something to me? Mm -hmm. Did you just say something to me? Mm -hmm. Do you have your phone on? Mm -hmm. Well, who was talking over there? 
Did you guys hear somebody talking or I'm just a lunatic? Well, hello, spirits, if you're here. How are you? Thank you for talking with us. I thought I heard something. I swore it was his phone. It was so clear, and I'm pretty sure it was a woman. Um, oh, that's just something. What was that noise? <laughs> okay. <laughs> was that noise from here? Okay, guys, I don't know what made that noise. <laughs> anyway, we'll try to get in the window again. There's what's in there. Um. Uh, I definitely have to listen back to this because I swore a woman was talking to me. <sighs> Over there. I don't know though. Here's what's in here. And now the windows are dirty, guys, so, so of course the white spots, a lot of it is just the dirt on the window, so excuse that. But Wow, look at that, huh? Oops. That's cool. That I haven't seen. That must be a new truck for them to do like the lawn work and stuff. That's pretty cool. It's cool. Almost looks like a military truck, but it's like a farming truck. That wasn't there the last time. Yep. But that's what's in there. I can show you this way, but I can't see, so you're probably not going to see anything. Um, there we go. Yep. So if you see anything in there, let me know. I think that's good. Cool. All right. So that is the gatehouse. Um, very interesting. I don't know what's on the second floor there. Let's see if we can get you close to the window. No, that must just be, <laughs> wait, let me, is there somebody, <laughs> no, that must be a shadow, I don't know, yeah, it must be the shadow, but well, that scared the shit out of me because it looked like a face, let me go this way, yeah, if you go this way, I don't see it, so it must have just been the way the shadow was, but <laughs> it scared the crap out of me, guys, don't be scaring me, <laughs> um, yeah, that, that's just the reflection of the tree when you stand this way. Okay, yeah, that's what it is. I think. We'll say it's that. Uh, I think that's what it is. Let me see, let's see. If I stand this way, there's less... I don't know. I don't see anything up there now. That was just an anomaly that scared me because of the way the trees were. But yeah, this place is totally awesome. Totally, totally awesome okay so now let's go to the cemetery <laughs> he's like okay go <laughs> if you walk behind that way there's just like a little um walking trail but the cemetery is in here <laughs> he won't go guys scaredy cat anyway maybe we'll we'll try some evps again in the cemetery but this time I'm gonna do it with the app I've really had good luck with that app really good EVPs um, I really like it I really think oh let me turn this out a little bit I really think uh, let me get back situated so it's clear again um, I really really like that app it is the SGK one make sure you get number one it has an EMF, it records, uh, it's really, really cool. This is the cemetery, the 
Let's see, we got some history on the board here. The cemetery is open. Uh, I'm gonna leave it there. Oh, I'm gonna leave it there because this shows you like everybody's graves and the numbers. See, the numbers correspond with where they are. So that's cool because some of them you can't see. So I'm really glad about that. I'll have to look at that later. Hi spirits, how are you? I hope you're well. I came to visit you a few times. Um, I did try to talk to you once. Oh, they took the fence down over there because I guess the tree was growing out of it. Um, wow, they really broke this apart, these freaking, I hope it's just, I hope it's not children playing because that's terrible. I really hope it's just old age that the fences are falling apart and that they, they fix them when they come back. Like I said, this is all run by right now. Um, Suffolk County and everybody who works here is um, volunteers okay so the volunteers do everything and it's pretty difficult a lot of them are older women uh, <laughs> so you know it's hard for them um, I tried to have Jonathan volunteer here but he's like oh <laughs> I don't know about that but um, just to help them because I think they need some young blood to help them anyway so yeah now in this cemetery they usually say they see a woman in white um, they say it's Elizabeth which is this big grave right here I don't know if that's true but Elizabeth if you're here hello to you I hope you're resting in peace what do you think of how they're keeping up the land Do you mind if I take out my spirit box to speak with you? I think we're going to do that, guys. I'm going to get my extra phone and I'm going to take out um, just my... I'll leave you guys filming. Um, just the phone app. Like, I'm not going to do that, take out the whole thing, I don't think. Because, like I said, the phone app really does pretty good. Um, so... I think we could do that. Um, so I'll take out the phone app. There's my boyfriend over there. He's recording too. Or something. I think he, I don't know if he's recording me or the cemetery. He doesn't really like cemeteries, so I'm surprised that <laughs> he's filming anything. But maybe he sees something. Oh, that's why he's filming. So, alrighty. So, what we're going to do is... Um, take out the SGK1 on this phone. Uh, you see how it has the EMF meter? So sometimes it gets stuck, the EMF meter. Oh no, but you see, it did go from three, oh, so it goes up and down. So there is an EMF meter. Wow, when you get near the graves. Um, it's pretty, it's far from my phone, so the phone wouldn't be doing it. Hmm. So when you go near the graves, it's three. Wow, maybe it's something in the stone, guys? I don't know. That's so weird to me. I'm going to put down my bag, though, because my bag is annoying me. Um, can I give you my bag, hun? For a second? So I could do some EVPs? Thanks. Okay. So, oh wow, it's like when I was, so that's so weird, because when I went like out, like near him, it really went to one, uh, and when you come back in the cemetery, and you go near the graves, it goes to around three, which is kind of weird. Okay, see, it goes up and down. So, I mean, this EMF is not perfect, because it's on the, well, but on the phone, but it, it does pick up something, which is cool. So we're going to turn on the spirit box. We're going to see if we could talk to everybody um, and see what we get. I don't know if you'll be able to hear this. 
I'll record too. Hello, spirits. How are you? You're good? Hi, who am I speaking with? I wanted to ask you, are you happy with how they're keeping the place up? Ooh, that was like a sentence, guys. Are you buried here in the cemetery? Elizabeth, they, if you're here, they say they see you sometimes. Do they see you in the cemetery? I wanted to ask you guys another question, if you don't mind. They've been telling us the history on this place. And I know you hear it because they have it here in the fair, right in the cemetery. Is the history that they tell us true? Is there some history they're leaving out? Hello, how are you? I'm sorry, I didn't introduce myself. Um, I'm Christina. I've been here before. I came to speak with you. I love the house. It's so beautiful. I come here to visit it because I think it's gorgeous. And did you help build this house? I appreciate you talking to me. I'm going to put this down right here if you don't mind. I'm curious, can you tell me something about the history that we don't know? Look 
camera's acting a little crazy. Like it keeps getting blurry, right? Can you tell me your name, who I'm speaking with? You know what, guys? I think I have a speaker in here. might help you guys. Sorry, I don't know what I'm recording, so I'm trying to get the speaker. I'm gonna see if it works, because that might be bad. I guess not. No, doesn't. Women. Women? Okay, that speaker doesn't work at this point. <laughs> Did you meet George Washington when he came here? Boyfriend's back there if you see him. If we see anything here, we know it's not him. Thank you so much for speaking with me. Did he say in the bedroom? Hmm. Can you tell me how many spirits reside on this property? That sounds like five, guys. Is the woman speaking with us Elizabeth or Mary? Sarah? I know I did see a Sarah. There's Sarah. Well, thank you for speaking with us, Sarah. Hemingway? Uh, is there any cocklings here?
Mm. Well, thank you for speaking with me. I'll come back again. I'm going to listen back and see what you said. So I can talk to you better the next time I come. But if, you, if you'd like to tell me anything, please do. I'll still be on the property just a little bit. And you can speak into my camera. Which is what I'm holding here, the phone. And we'll probably be able to hear you. Did one of you talk to me near the carriage house? Thank you again for speaking with me. And I'm going to say goodbye now. And I'll see you again soon. Please rest in peace. Take care. Okay, guys. So that was interesting. <clears throat> it's a lot of um, talking. So hopefully... We got um, some interesting stuff and something we can speak with them again about. Um, maybe they told us something about the history. Sorry, I'm just putting the, the other phone away. Maybe they told us something about the, the history or something about themselves that maybe we didn't know before, that maybe isn't written. Um, and that would be pretty cool. And you're more than welcome to show yourself on the camera, say hello. Um, yeah, but it's a super interesting place. Um, thank you again, everyone, for speaking with me and letting me look at the property. I appreciate it. Take care. So yeah, this is a pretty bell they have here, and I'm not sure why they have a bell right out the cemetery. Maybe they had the actual funerals here, and they used the bell for that. Um, not quite sure, uh, but you <laughs> look how tall it is, like you can't reach it to ring the bell. Uh, unless there's something you pull on it with. Um, but yeah. So that is this place. Um, I really love this place. Only because it's just so gorgeous. There is just so much history here. Spirits or not. It's awesome. We are going to go across the street now. To the park. Um, I have not done EVPs there. Because there's always been tons and tons of people. But we'll see if there's not some um, quiet places there we have a car here I don't know what he's doing here uh, oh it's a guy and a girl they're looking to make out <laughs> I always say that when I see a guy and a girl coming to a historical place and they're young I'm like they're coming to make out because nobody's going to come here we are here, but we are leaving, so they came at a good time. <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll take one more look at the house as we're leaving. And like I said, if you guys see anything that I don't note in the video or in the comments below, please let me know. Um, that'd be awesome. Um, if you see anything in the windows, if you hear anything audio wise 
that I did not hear. I can't wait to listen back to what was said near the um, near the barn because I know somebody was talking to me. Um, well, the carriage house is what they call it. But yeah. Um, so they have fence now. But there used to be so much more to this property. I'm going to see if I can find pictures. Probably not because absolutely nothing in the history of Bayshore has been recorded. <laughs> I really have to find a historian that actually knows something because they really hide most of their history, which is weird to me. But they keep this, and that's why I asked the spirits about their history. What they're not telling us because I can't imagine... They're telling the full story about this either. They just tell you what they want you to know. But anyway, that's one more look at the house. Goodbye, spirits. Take care. Thanks for speaking with us. And, uh, yeah, Sagatos Manor Park. See, they have the tour hours. Uh, June, July, August, and September only. Um... Which is, you know, summertime during the winter, they don't have it. Oh, they changed the fence out, I think, because the fence used to be white. So they changed the fence, because this is all new. And I wonder why they took out the nice white fence and put this weird 